What up, my dudes? It's Max from Papillon Effect, and I think it's about time for another beer plays. Roll that theme music! Take a sip. Mm. Delicious. Delicious. Uh, we're back again with some Lily, Child of Geos. It's a pretty funny game so far. I was, uh, I was currently talking to the guide fish. What's his name? A Mr. Information Fish or something? Where do the big red doors lead? No hello this time? You didn't say hello last time either. Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. Sense of information. <laughs> Sensitive information fish. Hello. Uh. Oh, he's information fish. Sensitive information fish. Now, because he, he, he got upset. What was your question again? Where did the big red doors go? Didn't you say, where did the big red doors lead the first time you asked me that? Why would you remake me repeat myself if you heard the question the first time? You didn't say hello, so I wasn't sure if you were speaking to me or this tree or to the sky or this, or to this. I mean, there's a lot of sentient trees or wood creatures around here. That is a legitimate statement. Are you going to answer my question? Talk to me again if you need any more information. I like this guy. Hello. He's an asshole. Hello, information fish. What do you need this time? I was going to follow up with you about the big red doors. What was the question again? Where did the big red doors lead? Didn't you say where did the big red doors go the second time you asked me that? Okay, now you're just being stupid. I can't tell if you already know where they go, and sometimes you repeat yourself but change some of the words. <coughs> Besides, I don't really have much information about the village or the city on the other side of the big red doors. You could just say that there's a village or a city on the other side. Okay, I will do that next time. Talk to me again if you need any more information. <laughs> Hello. Hello, information fish. How is it you can live outside of water? What do you mean? Why would I need to be in water? Where I come from, most fish can't survive out of the water long. Where you come from sounds very stupid. <laughs> I like this guy. Hello. Hello, information fish. Tell me a joke. What's the difference between a piano and a fish? You can tune a piano, but you can't tune a fish! Mm-hmm. I already knew that dad joke. That was very bad. <laughs> My information fish, do you know any surfside history? The spirits created this place for the constructs to live. One day there was a great earthquake. The mayor used his powers to rebuild surfside. He probably could have done a better job. <laughs> I guess the constructs have to take what they can get. I don't know, this place seems pretty functional already. I mean, it's even got like wood toilets and like stoves and shit. With watermelon trees. Wait. I know, well, yeah, watermelons grow on vines and stuff. Oh, look at that. I didn't see that before, that looks fucking cool. Yeah, this place looks alright, man. Hello. Hello, information fish. How is it that you can live outside of water? Oh, she asked that. I guess she's starting to repeat them now. Uh, skipping. Let me ask again. Hello. Tell me a joke. Yeah, okay. He's just gonna repeat himself now. That's very bad. I didn't realize last time. Um. But the. The, the birds poop. They shit rainbow colored. Um, those big red doors, I can't figure out how to open them. I think I'm supposed to be in a village called Splitwood. Okay. Well, you fucked up then. Um, you definitely fucked up then. <laughs> uh, oh, but she got shit on. I thought she stepped in shit. I didn't realize she got shit on in the last episode. And I was just like, huh, oh, oh, fucking birds. <laughs> like, that's funny. That's very funny. I think it's funny when kids get shit on. I'm sure this whole YouTube video is dedicated to like little kids getting shit on by birds. <laughs> the telespotter. This is a classic tip. This is a classic. Typical type seen on the front of many ships. Equally useful for island spotting or checking out what the neighbors are up to. It collapses into a smaller form in case you're caught peeking. Okay. So it's watching neighbors get undressed. It's pretty fucked up. My dude, my neighbor, um, 
Mike Albrecht, and I don't mind saying his fucking name because he's a piece of shit. Like, I guess this dude, like, he, he mentioned it one time when he was fucking drunk, but he, he had, like, a telescope, and he'd watch my mom get out of the shower. And he mentioned it in front of me, too. Like, haha, isn't that fucking funny? And it was like, no, that's really fucked up. That's really fucked up. Hey! I'm um, hello, fine construct, sir. <laughs> oh, good day, young plankton. I'm Walter Shippington the 14th. I run this establishment and trade for useful items. Excellent, that sounds useful, but I don't really have a Shippington Rewards card on me. <laughs> How do I pay for shit? Baha, <laughs> young friend, I take coins and only coins, but also dildos. Nothing but dildos and coins. Don't even try to pay me with anything but coins and dildos. I'd say off with you. <laughs> uh, sweet. Okay, okay, I take flowers too. Well, I'll buy flowers from you, so really it's still coins. And dildos. Just bring me coins or flowers or dildos, we'll work it out easy peasy, but fuck easy. Oof, huff. Okay. Um, it said these boots are temporary. These boots make you run kind of fast. Speed boots, level one. Um, I don't really want to buy something that's temporary. Especially since the skeleton key right there is 6,000 and it opens everything. I kind of just want to save up for that and then like cheese dick. You know what I mean? I'm all about cheese dicking it in the game. <clears throat> I was also thinking about, cause like last time I got this far and then I was like, oh, none of her outfits, like, I mean, they all kind of look, they're all the same. She's still very kawaii. Except for these ones, these ones are like, boring. Um, yeah, she's cute enough in the one she's wearing. Oh, a word if I may. If you're new to the island, you should seek out the trainer. Trainer is in the hut like mine, but with the red roof. Exit my shop and turn right, can't miss it. Hey! Cool beans! Find a train in the roof hut. Alright, whatever. Fucking... Oh, I'm gonna be moving to a new apartment soon. I'm fucking excited, I'm away from all these motherfuckers here. Assholes, jackasses, siphoning me of my money. My hard-earned money that I never actually get to spend on cool shit other than... Well, I do, I do make sure I spend money on video games. Oh, actually, my entire Steam library was pretty much bought before, except for Final Fantasy XV. Um, that's the only newest game I bought, and I bought it fresh, specifically just because it was so fucking awesome, and had the Steam, the Steam Workshop shit. It was cool beans. Oh. Dope. Check out this place. You need to clean up, though. You get bowls and shit out. What's up, my dude? Excuse me, did you just go quack, quack, quack? Hello, young sapling, I am no one. Oh, wait, hold on. <clears throat> What's a good voice? Uh... Yosh! Hello, young sapling, I am known as the trainer. I know a horrible name. Blame the spirit, though. How can we be of use to each other? Yosh! <laughs> my name is Lily, I'm completing my veggie magical degree. <laughs> <laughs> like, she's like straight up like, I'm here because of college. I got really fucking lost though. So I'm looking for magical flowers. <coughs> I think the magical flowers are what they put in that soup to make people get all fucking high. I wouldn't mind learning some more about the spirits while I'm here. Uh, you are most fortunate, friend Lily. I can help you. We have all sorts of special flowers on the island of Geos. A lot of them are psychoactive. When you get near a flower, press E to pick it up. Go explore the air, gather five white flowers, but not the black ones, they'll shoot you, and return. After that, we converse about rare specimens. Sounds like a plan. I'll head out and let you know what I find. Thanks for the advice. I'm always here. <laughs> Why? He even does it, too. I'm here to help give, I'm here to give, to give helpful advice if you're lost. Now, off you go. I thought he was going to teach me how to fight, but no, I got to get five flowers? Um... Well, where the fuck do I go then? Splitwood? Yeah, like they shit on the floor right there. They can also shit on Lily. <laughs> Which I think is probably the better- Oh, here. That's one of the white flowers I'm here to collect. Okay, cool. Sweet. Found one. Four more to go. That one kind of just popped up in front of me, didn't it? So maybe I, maybe I just gotta walk in a circle or, or walk around and then I'll know. Just, oh, there's this one. Dose.
Dry. Excellent specimen. Orthinicus Lilustrium. Oh, it's it's it glows. Okay. Uh, right. Cat. She. Hmm. It's weird. Why would it grow on wood or on uh oh there's another one. You know, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna start grabbing all the fucking ton a ton of these. Did it come back? Oh it's a pot, but I couldn't see it. Dope. Oh and another flower. I stopped counting in foreign languages. Cause I don't know past five in most of them. Yeah, and that one dude said he'll sell he'll sell flowers to me. Or he'll buy the flowers off me. I wonder how much they're worth then. Aha, uh -huh, there's one over here. Oh but I can't get there. Um Okay. I didn't set an alarm this time. I gotta get in, I gotta get into the the fucking the groove of setting an alarm. I think I'll do this I'll do this one in episodes of 20 minutes. That seems uh, that seems more bearable. I, I looked at what the clock was roughly after I started, so I, I kind of have it figured out. <clears throat> it doesn't really lend itself well to a beer place, though. Because uh, I'm not, I'm not actually like drinking it. I'm just kind of playing and taking like, occasional sips. Because the beer used to be the timer. At least it, it is for when I just play till the beers. Like something like Final Fantasy, where it's just a full-on adventure. I'll, I'll do full up. Like I'll do episodes like that. But um, it's like it's gonna be like an hour and a half gameplay footage. But for this, where it's 20 minute chunks, um, I don't finish the beer. <laughs> I mean, I finish it. I'm not gonna waste it. But I'll just, I'll go do something else while I wait. Or will I finish it up? Because if I just slam it right afterwards... I did that on a, on a Hat in Time a couple times. When I played that, that Let's Play and I got fucked up. Real fucked up. It was fun. It was amazing. But it wasn't as interesting. One time it was interesting. But another time I just got boring. I watched through it and I was like, oh, was, I'm not actually talking, I'm just playing. It's not worth it then. You gotta talk. It's not. It's not a gameplay channel. I guess it is a gameplay channel. Hell yeah. These better not be worth like one fucking gold or something stupid like that. Uh. I guess in theory I should see what they're worth first before I go around collecting a shit ton. So I'm not upset with myself for wasting time. Actually, you know what? These are probably used to catch spirits or something. Because I, I feel that's that's supposed to be a mechanic of the game. You stealth, and then you jump on them. And then you hang on their back and you like pull shit off them or something. It's like, that's how the combat mechanic works. Uh, okay, so let's see what let's see what he sells them for. Or he, he buys them for. Welcome back, fine girl. Do you have some business to conduct? Uh, yeah, I'm trying to get that fucking skeleton key. Wait. Oh, it's worth 20 apiece. Okay. Okay. I think we can work with that. Select an item. Oh, I see. Um... It still would be a bit of a grind to get that skeleton to keep, but we're pretty close. You know, I'm not gonna be butthurt. Oh, shit! Hey Chump, what are you doing with those flowers? Dude. Fuck off. Hey. Oh neat, a spirit. Hi, I'm collecting samples for a report. Something wrong? Yes, yeah, something's wrong. Give me those flowers, meaty, uh, meaty head. Yoink. What? Haha, <laughs> look at you now. Yo, fuck you, dude. Hey. Took five of those. I picked those, bitch. Yeah, exactly. Later, hand face. Yo, I'm gonna fuck you up if I can later. What was that? Seriously. 
There are boys here? What am I, 12 again? I need to see the trainer. <clears throat> yeah, explain to the trainer. Be like, look, dude, this guy jacked my shit. How do I fuck him up? And I'd be like, oh, Dino-san. You know, Kung Fu. Karate, Karate. Is a way of life. It is about balance. And I'd be like, fuck that, I'm going to Cobra Kai. You're a piece of shit. Yo, this dude stole my stuff. Show me how to sweep the leg. Hello again. I trust you have five white flowers. White? Hmm. I had them. Then his masked thing showed up and stole them. Oh yeah, so you've met Pignut. He's a spirit doing what spirits do. Fast. Being jerks. I believe, don't we all have spirits within us? I don't know if that's in this game. World. Actually, the most potent rare flowers grow on the back of spirits, like Pignut. I see. <coughs> we lowly constructs are strictly forbidden to interact with the spirits. <coughs> but someone like you could. So you mean I could kick his ass? I could what? What do you mean? Interact. You could leap on upon a spirit and pluck the flowers right off his back. I must admit, I would quite like to see that. <laughs> okay, sure. So wait, I can't... I can just, what, jump on a spirit and yank its flowers off? Are you serious? Yeah, I want to steal from him too. Show me how. Serious as moss rot. Uh, you can gather all the amazing flower samples you need. Oh, right, I'm here to get flowers, I forgot. Okay, I guess I'm in. Where do I find Pignut? Our island is divided into quarters by the Great Wall. Surfside is for uh, our constructs, but Pignut hangs out here and torments us. Just head out and look for the creatures in mass and grab them. Good luck. Interesting. Chase him, collect his flowers. Okay. So, I look around, find some spirits, jump on them, and yank their flowers off. This is crazy. <laughs> there he is, Pigna. Time for a rematch, bitch. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. Well, I guess that's where the, the running ab ability comes in. Don't I have a skip sandwich? I do. I'm not gonna use it yet, though. Oh, cool, I got a red one. What up, bitch? Way to sucker punch someone. If I was ready, you'd be on the ground right now. Believe that. And I got some coinage. Oh, and they, they, they rate you depending on how well you do. Cool. Pigment, gender male. Age 14. Fun fact, sometimes eats his own sap. Fucking gross. Favorite book, The Taking Tree. Pigment dislikes constructs just a little too much. Often his mother finds them in Surfside pulling petals from flowers while wearing an unsavory expression. Rematch? Yeah, I want a rematch. Can't believe I just did that. I just beat some dude up and took his shit. Fuck yeah, welcome to Earth. Um, did I get enough? Do I have the skeleton key ability now? Oh, I'm close. I want, oh, you know, I'll go talk to the trainer, cause, and then I'll sell these fucking flowers. Because I want to get enough flowers. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> Spirits? Can I can I just rematch him? I can rematch him. Uh, it didn't. I clicked the rematch button. Oh well. Time for a rematch. Hey, I'm back, Professor Pettigrew. is going to be so proud of this shit. Well done, Lily. You've beaten up a dude and took any shit. You have a rare spirit flower for your collection, and you struck a blow for the cause. The cause? What are you talking about? I'm doing schoolwork. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's like if you bombed a building or something, or, or like took out a dude, you know, and it's like, oh, he, he, you're part of the resistance. It's like, no, that guy was just, I was, I'm just doing homework. My homework was to beat his ass. I think a thing can be too, Lily. The spirits are harsh masters. 
They create us construct constructs to serve machines. We do our duties uh, as designed or we cease. But we are not simple machines. We have souls. When you deflower a spirit like Pignut, their grasp weakens. Uh, I'm sorry, this is all a bit much. I need to focus on my report or my whole life has been wasted. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't give a shit about you. Uh, I've got my gender studies degree I've got to take care of. Lily, with your help, and he just keeps going. With your help, our souls could be free, and you'll find everything you need you need for your school. Aww. He's like, but I'm no freedom fighter. Tackling that spirit took a lot out of me. I don't know if I'm up to this. That, my friend, is my role. Drop a knee and watch me work. Uh, choose a stat. Grip. The higher the stat, the longer you can stay on a spirit when harvesting flowers. Okay. The higher the stat, the faster you will run. Cool. The higher the stat, the closer you will be able to get to a spirit before being noticed. Right. Uh, this one sounds like a good one first. See how easy it is to advance? You're pliable like plywood. I don't think plywood is actually... Never mind. Hush. You defeat three more spirits in this area, then we will see about getting you into Splitwood Village. He's, here's an honorary training bandana. You received a karate bandana. You got a hat or a mask. Put it on Lily from the menu. Oh, okay. About all about Lily. Touch the menu item to see details about it. Karate. Uh, nah, she's cute like that. <clears throat> okay. Oh, I see. There he is again. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. Bitch. Yeah. Oh, so you can only get a certain amount. What a sucker push, Summer. If I was free, you'd be on the ground right now. Believe that. You ran away, bitch. Yeah. Best new. Mask earned. What did I, I got a mask? Uh, pro tip, think you can improve, rematch the spirit. Oh shit! Oh shit, she threw me on the ground. He's all happy about it. Handsome, tough, and single, ladies, watch out. Well, at least he was happy. Coming back at you. I don't understand. Yep. I think there's an order it wants you to do them in, but I can't tell. I grew those buds for a special lady, now you ruined everything. Yeah, I'll give you a haircut. <laughs> now I got one. Douglas? Uh, age inappropriate. <laughs> Fun fact, trying to set things right. Handsome and very approachable until you get a good long conversation with them. Definitely not bring home to your mama material. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, rematch. Just two more. I clicked the rematch button, it doesn't seem to work. Hold on. Pretty close to... I'm gonna sell my flowers. Oh wait, hold on. I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna chase him again. I'm gonna chase him. I, I gotta figure out this mini game, man. Oh, this guy's different. Haha. <laughs> Come here, Douglas. Come here. Hey. 
Oh, I see. You only grab the ones that are... Okay. Okay, just t take your time. Like, I didn't realize that some flowers were red, and I guess that's supposed to, I guess that's supposed to be, uh, they hurt your hand. Alright, so I gotta pay attention to that shit. Come here, bitch. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna tell the mayor about this. You wait right here. You're in big trouble. Big. Nice. Masker and sassafras. Age lost track on purpose. Female, weight 23 pounds under. Trying to stay cute. Two things were on Sassafras's mind when she met the girl. Is she gonna take my flowers? And she just took my flowers. <laughs> she gonna take my flowers? And she just took my flowers. <laughs> I might get, get the hang of this. Defeat one more spirit. Okay. All right. So I got some masks. Hats? No hat. Pigment's mask, Pear drop mask, no hat. All right. Yo, mailbox. It's my second favorite girl made of like flesh. Who's the fucking first? Getting pretty close to that that skeleton key. Oh, here we are. <sighs> Come here, motherfucker. I'm coming for you. Oh, after this, I need to. I need to make a new, start a new episode. Okay. Fuck. Is this gonna be bombs again? That felt good? No, no it didn't, just so you know. Nice. Hawthorne, and I got his mask. Gender male, age close enough, <laughs> close enough. Photo fact, very suspicious. Turns out wearing skates to the beach was just bad, as bad an idea as not wearing sunscreen. Epic sunburn to match his epic skates. <laughs> what? <laughs> I like Hawthorne. He's a crazy motherfucker. Alright, I gotta visit the well, first. Uh, oh, whatever. Oh, I got mail. You've got mail. Ho, oh, visitor, I'm Mailbot. Uh, you're a bot? I have a message for you here. Yeah! <laughs> hmm. You know, I'll just take the letters from your mouth. Derp, enough. Yeah, come on. <laughs> oh, cool, a message from Professor Pettigrew. Greetings, Lily. Congratulations on reaching Geos and beginning your quest to collect veggie magical samples. It's very prestigious. I'm writing specifically to remind you to log what you find in your journal. Your final grade will depend on that knowledge. Best of luck. I look forward to your thesis. Sincerely, Professor Pettigrew. Aww. Oh, that was nice of him. Thanks, uh, mailbox man. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> See ya. <clears throat> Alright. Good fun, good fun. Okay, so, um, I, that, that was that episode, some crazy shit, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.